My name is Rhapsody, and welcome back to Fallout 4. Alrighty then. Probably change out my gun. Yeah, there we go, for the longer range one. And it's probably time also that we actually stick kind of on the general path of the mission that we're supposed to be playing. I don't know. So, I believe what we've currently got is a clear out quest. Ooh, hang on. Wild corn. Thank you. Thank you. And thank you again. Sunshine Tidings Co-op. Yeah, clear out Sunshine Tidings Co-op. So, is this... It's not heavily fortified enough to be raiders. Raiders typically seem to fortify absolutely everything that they get in contact with. I wonder what they're afraid of. Oh. I'm in danger, apparently. To this rad roach, which actually to its credit, has managed to hit me twice. Alright, we'll just have Dogmeat finish that one up for us. Don't really want to be wasting 308 rounds on that. Feral Ghoul Reaver. Okay, I'm gonna guess that we've got ghouls around this area then. It's, it's hardly a guess and more of an observation at this point, but still. Nothing really in here. Fine, there was coffee pot, but yeah, whatever. Don't really care. So I guess I'm pretty much just gonna have to go house to house, because the ghouls... Don't tend to be out in the open when at all avoidable. Well, that rad roach managed to get me again. Hello? Never mind, you're already dead. There's also Professor Goodfields around here, who I believe was a Mr. Handy that we saw hanging out. Yep, we should probably talk to him at some point, see if he wants to help us at all. I'm gonna guess that's a no on the helping us then. Where'd you go, Dogmeat? Dogmeat's barking his goddamn head off. Yes, okay, I'll loot the first aid kit. Kickball, sure. Sunshine Tidings Terminal, unlock as a novice, don't mind if I do. Still. No. Uh, where's... Got one likelihood. Okay, it could be relay. No likeliness, damn. Okay, let's find some matching uh, brackets, shall we? One pair. It only removes a dud, unfortunately. There's a second pair. Tries reset. Excellent. So it can't be scant. Can't be rolls. I know it's scant, don't worry. Uh... Can be wiser? Yeah. No, apparently it can't be wiser. Trace. It can be trace. Sweet. Gotcha. Mr. Handy Control. Okay, shut down unit. No, choose protocols. Just B or guard protocols. Let's go with guard protocols. Uh huh. And then let's go for a log as well. Alan, we finally sprung a slave from the squares for our Freedom Farm co op, a Mr. Handy from Nardaville suburbs. The tin can wigged out, almost trying to go back to his slave owners, almost clued the fuzz onto us, so Johnny noodled it out and zonked his motivation protocols to just be. Now we call him Professor Goodfields, just digging the world as it be. Oh, and nothing to nobody. Careful with his other protocols. These can knuckle creeps. These cans knuckle creeps if they go ape. Not me, surely. May I help you? Okay, so he's basically defense for the town, I'm feeling. Okay. Yep, I'm hearing some stuff going on in here. Feral Ghoul. Ah, this looks like a kill shot. Boom. Mostly I'm doing this to work up crit at the moment, but uh, if I can kill enemies at the same time, why not? Gotcha. Whoa. I was wondering where the other sounds were coming from, but maybe... Oh, okay, no, it's just when I'm down on my grounds. On my grounds, on the grounds, that he might get aggro if I pickpocket him. Okay, that's fair enough. 
I wouldn't like being pickpocketed either. Oven mitt, sure. Grain knit cap, sure as well. Extinguisher razor grain. We're going to have to plant some stuff here, won't we? At some point. Someone will tell us to plant things here. Dog meat? What'd you find? You found an outhouse. With a... Ooh, box of bobby pins. Actually incredibly useful. No? That's not what you found? Yeah, that's what you found, buddy. I'm telling you right now, you didn't find anything else. Come back to me when you have good news. Novice lock. Easy. That's it. Oh, God. Anyone else? Doesn't look like it. Perfect. Take the bone sword. Take rat away. Take a broken lamp. First aid. Anything in there. Double rat X. Perfect. Restored desk fan. I hear those are valuable, by the way. Just in case you're unaware. Awesome. Inconsequential papers on the floor. Perfect. Excuse me, Professor Goodfields. Excuse me, sir. Thank you. If you can clear the path, I have some things I would like to attend to. Is there anything in here? Doesn't even look like it. Perfect. Take the subway token and nothing else. Really? This entire place is empty except for that. No, we've got a ceramic bowl and chef hat. I'll take the ceramic bowl because I do actually need to go back and start leveling up my armor. And apparently... Alert viewer Brian has noted that uh, ceramic plus the vault suit is apparently supposed to be a real good combination, so I'll get on top of that as soon as I can. Basically, as soon as I've cleared out this area, I should be able to teleport home and then teleport back here immediately afterwards, which is ultimately my goal. Whoa! Yes! One down. The other one isn't even triggered to get up yet. But it is deceased. Ooh, damn. The settlers here didn't really... Didn't work out well for them, evidently. Oh, Feral Ghoul with a gold watch and she had a silver watch? Did... Did the person she was settling with ghoulify? Is that what's occurred here? Oh, Wasteland oh, Survival yeah. Guide. You've collected an issue of the Wasteland Survival Guide. Permanently collect extra meat from animal kills. Don't mind if I do. More brain fungus. Incredible amount of good stuff, plus a strengthened alloyed metal right leg. Carrying too much and can't run. Fine, whatever. Uh, do I have a good right leg at the moment? Yeah, I do. I have the acrobat's leather right leg. How much better is this? Way better at damage resistance. Hang on. 11 versus 4. Or was it 6? Yeah, 11 versus 4. That's pretty significant. If I'm not taking falling damage, or if I'm not planning to take falling damage anytime soon, and I definitely am not, then uh, Acrobat's Leather Right Leg can probably be something I ignore for a while. Chef Hat increases luck? What? Grain Knit Cap also increases luck. Fine, then I'll drop that one. Cool, I don't need a bunch of the same weapon at all. No reason would I need that. I'll take one of the hunting rifles, the other one's not important. Plus, if I'm dropping them here, I can come back for them at any point. It's not exactly like they're gonna leave. Okay, I shouldn't be over encumbered anymore, and it does not feel like I am. Excellent. Hmm? Cap stash. Anything else? No, that looks like about it for us. Perfect. May I help you exterminate? Well, now that the area is clear, I think he can go back to just B mode. There is no reason that he needs to be so hyperactive at this point. Uh, sh Whoop! Never mind, I turned it off. No, not console. Let's activate the unit. Let's choose the protocol to... Time for maintenance. No, let's just go to the Just B protocols. Excellent. 
chemistry station is here, and there is also a workshop. Uh huh. Wooden crates, perfect. So I can just destroy things around here. It. What do you want from me? The quest has changed, hasn't it? Yes, build and activate a recruitment radio beacon. Not really interested at the moment in doing that. That seems like more settlement stuff. I don't know about making more settlement stuff. I want to fix my armor, and I also want to check if you can actually modify champion legendary equipment. Because I'm not certain about whether or not you can actually get that done. So, first off, let's try the armor. So, champion's left arm. I definitely want this. So, I've got polished metal at the moment. Which is second level of endurance, so obviously I can't make that better. And I've got strengthened, which is also first level of armor, so I can't really make that better, unfortunately. I'm busy. Did you just come up to me to tell me that you're busy, Sturgis? God damn. Alright, uh, what do we got here? We've got insulated lining to improve energy resistance. Uh, there's treated lining. Shielded lining? I need rank 4 of science and rank 4 of armorer. Damn. Okay, so I can't really do that much with the vault jumpsuit, unfortunately. Metal right arm. Painted metal. Improves damage. Res fine, yeah. It's using adhesive, though, which I actually have very little of right now. Yep, I'll take pocketed, certainly. Uh, I'm using a exterminator metal left leg. Oh, cool, I can actually upgrade this as well. Nice. No, never mind, I actually can't upgrade that. Not right now, at least. You're treated leather and lead lined. Yeah, I can't upgrade either of those. No, those are already better than what I can do. What about my base set? Can I upgrade my base set? Like, what is it I'm wearing under all of these? It's the green and something, 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 something. Yeah, green shirt. No, I'm not. I'm wearing military fatigues. Okay. Can I upgrade the military fatigues? No, they are unupgradable. Same with the green leather, whatever. Okay. Champion left arm. So it's time to rename some of these so that I know that they're always the thing that I want to put on. So champion left arm uh, becomes buff mother... F no, it's going to be the... Buff Bill's left, Buff Bill's left arm. That's good enough. The metal left leg. Now, what is this? It's for reduction of damage by Myalurks and Bugs. So, reduction of damage by Myalurks and Bugs. Hmm... I would go with Exterminator, but it was already called the Exterminator. Uh, it's the Pest Control left leg. Pocketed Painted Metal Right Arm. This one's actually not that important, so it's... Hmm. It's not important by base, so what can it be called? Stock, standard, right, um, and then the strengthened alloyed metal right leg. This one's actually pretty good, but it's also basically stock stand- ah, no, 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 don't scrap it. Uh, stock, standard, right leg. So buff bills left arm. Ooh, we've also got the chest piece that I should name. Hmm. Leaded treated leather. Uh, just call it lead leather. 
chest piece. Hey. It'll be a lot easier for me to remember what I want to wear now that I've actually got them named. And also, time to check out... So, Righteous Authority. Oh, she wants a chair. Reduced ammo capacity, but improved damage. Now, your damage... So, it's actually significant damage. That's eight damage per shot. Uh, adds burning damage, improves the wa uh, range. That's pretty cool, too. Photon Agitator. Oh, okay, so I can't do anything until I get some levels of science for these ones. Photon Exciter. I think I probably just want to go for the boosted capacitor. Alright, then there's nothing I can do with the barrels. Oh, they all require science, apparently. These also all require science. These require science, and let me guess, these probably... Yeah, it looks like they require science. Uh, I'm gonna guess that it might be the same with this. Yep. Requires science for the upgrade. On... What? Oh, I just don't have adhesive for this one. I want that, I want that though. What? I could get scopes! Oh, come on! I just don't have adhesive. Alright, let's do some trashing. Sorry? Uh, sure. Can't you just use any chair? The site's been real exhausting lately. Got aches and pains. Even when I'm lying down. I know it's odd asking for a fitted chair in this day and age, but it really helped me out, kid. Have you got a blueprint for that chair? Sure. I'm glad to help. Thank you. Build Mama Murphy's chair in Sanctuary. If I build this, is Preston Garvey going to get annoyed at me? Oh, okay, so it's special. It's a special item, cool. Uh, so Mama Murphy, where do I want you to sit? Um, I guess I just don't want it to really interact with any other things. Sure, I'll put it in the house, but I will cancel for a second, and then I'll store that, and store that, and I'll put it here. Okay, so there's a special tab. Interesting. Gotcha. Take care of yourself, dear. Whoa, she teleported directly through me. I need to sit down, kid. Okay, go sit down. No, she didn't have any speech no. she wanted to have with me. Perfect. Okay, uh, let's go back to... Right, transferring. Let's store all junk, first off. And then you can cook Tato and a bunch of other stuff into adhesive, right? Now, where do I... Where would I go to do that? Because I've got some Tato and some Mute Fruit. So I don't know where that would actually occur. First off, let's just check if we actually now have the adhesive after doing what I just did. Uh, so it's the... Kneecapper. We have still no adhesive. Interesting. Hmm. How do I break down these? Where is... Mute fruit? I assume maybe a chemistry station is required? There's some Tato. Yeah, probably a chemistry station. Let's see if I can make one of those. Unless, of course, making a chemistry station requires... Uh, requires local leader, yeah. That's kind of annoying. Uh, the other area that I just came from, however, does have a chemistry station. Let's go back there. Sunshine Tidings Co-op. Oh, Robco Fun has... Oh, games for your Pip-Boy. That's cool. We're very close to a level up to level 12. 
which I think is just going to go either immediately into Armourer, Science, or Intelligence. Maybe Strong Back. Oh, it's a Radstorm. All right. Let's try and get inside. Okay, and that's the workshop I don't want to be using. Perfect. Now, doesn't buff jet I can make? That's kind of cool. Cutting fluids, syringe ammo, healing. No, this isn't looking good. Psycho jet, psycho buff. Oh man, psycho buff. That's pretty crazy. Okay, so I can't actually make anything here, unfortunately. Maybe it's a cooking station that's required? Huh. Uh, there is a cooking station up here. Let's try that. Utility, vegetable starch, breaks down into adhesive, yeah. So I need corn, mute fruit, and tato, which I apparently don't have. I have one tato. Did it disappear? Hmm... I'm going to definitely need to set up a farm for that type of stuff because adhesive is... It's proving to be very, very, very difficult to come by. Crafting, no. Defense, no. Power? What is it I'm looking for here? Well, I know what I'm looking for. Miscellaneous. Recruitment radio beacon. Perfect. That's exactly what I'm looking for. Cha-ching! And it requires one power, which means that I will need to generate a generator. A medium generator. I could do a medium generator. What am I using? Not that much stuff, to be completely honest. Windmill I kind of want as well, actually. But uh, medium generator. Maybe I find a building, build a medium generator. Or I could just build the medium generator here, right by it. That actually seems like a pretty good idea. Then I need to wire again. Perfect. No, I don't want to store it. Are you kidding me? I just built it. Okay, and now we're recruiting people. Hell yeah. I wonder if in-game time has to pass for it to actually have any effect and to have people turn up. Okay, good. It was actually active. Ooh, I did not know there were things in here. That is a very primitive toilet. Yeah, that's actually definitely a toilet. I kind of want to replace that with an actual toilet right now. Now, I need local leader, and then I need to set up a bunch of maps so that this workshop is connected to my other workshop, so that I don't actually have to lug stuff between them. That's going to be annoying to do, but it's something that we're going to have to do uh, way off in the far future, because we're not going to do it right now. Good lord, are we not going to do it right now. My name is Ben Rhapsody, the name of the game has been Fallout 4. Hopefully you've been enjoying yourself. If you have, please click like, it doesn't help get my content out to new people. There's also a playlist in the description down below with all my content on this video game and its series. Past, present, future, and hopefully we will see you next time.